All right, so apparently some crazy sh stuff went down when I was asleep last night. I mean, just when you think the seventh anniversary has peaked, just when you think it can't possibly get better because it's already the greatest anniversary in the history of this game. It just keeps getting better and better. So in case you guys missed the news, there is going to be a Dokkan Festival exclusive, Captain Ginyu. That's number one, something I've been asking for for a very long time, so super happy about that. Uh, number two, the full uh, free-to-play team Bardock. They're all going to be getting Extreme Sea Awakenings, I think including the LR team Bardock. So that's six EZAs right there. And then we're also going to be getting a new free-to-play LR in a LR Goku Jr. and Vegeta Jr. And finally, the LR Super Saiyan 4s. Uh, from the 4th anniversary, whose uh, Extreme Sea Awakenings I wasn't expecting until next year. I thought it was, you know, going to be like a 8th anniversary kind of thing. I thought they would just EZA a new set of anniversary LRs every year going forward, right? But no, apparently, <laughs> apparently they're getting them right now, guys. <laughs> they're getting them right now. Now, my throat is all messed up right now. So I don't know if you guys can tell, but my voice is probably a little bit off. But it's fine, we'll get through it, and uh, yeah, let's check out the details for these LR Super Saiyan 4s, because we don't know what the Team Bardock does yet, we don't know what the um, Goku Jr. and Vegeta Jr. do yet, and we don't know what Captain Ginyu, the Dokkan Fest Ginyu does, uh, but we do know what the LR Super Saiyan 4s do after their upcoming Extreme Zeo Awakening, which is still just ridiculous to me. I was... I did not see this coming, guys. I did not see this coming. Okay, so starting with the Super Saiyan 4 Goku, before the EZA, leader skill, Goku's family category, key plus 3, HP and attack plus 170%, and defense plus 130%. Or Super AGL types, key plus 3, HP, attack, and defense plus 120%. 12 key super attack, massively raises defense for one turn, and causes colossal damage, and 18 key super massively raises attack and defense for one turn and causes mega class of damage. I just realized we don't have any background music. That's unfortunate. It's okay. I'll add it in after, actually. It's cool. Um, yeah, so 18 key massively raises attack and defense for one turn. It causes mega class of damage. Passive is attack plus 80% and defense plus 20% at the start of each turn up to 80% plus an additional key plus 2 per rainbow or AGL key sphere obtained. Medium chance of evading enemy super attack and countering with tremendous power. And his active skill is massively raises attack temporarily and causes ultimate damage to enemy. And uh, you can activate it during the fourth turn from start of battle once only. So that's before the EZA. Now with the EZA, new leader skill is Goku's family, key plus three, HP attack and defense plus 120%. Or Super AGL types, key plus 3, HP attack and defense plus 130%. 12 key massively raises, <clears throat> sorry, 12 key massively raises defense and raises attack for one turn and causes colossal damage. And uh, 18 key is massively raises attack and defense for one turn and causes mega colossal damage and greatly lowers defense. New passive, attack and defense plus 140%. So we went from 80% attack to attack and defense plus 140% plus an additional attack plus 20% at the start of each turn up to 60% plus an additional key plus 2 per rainbow or HL key sphere obtained plus an additional key plus 1 per type key sphere obtained AGL excluded and medium chance of evading enemy super attacks and countering with tremendous power nullifies enemies actions for one turn when facing two or more enemies, when using an active skill, or when performing a super attack when key is 24. Okay, so this last part is actually kind of crazy. So when you use an active skill, you essentially destroy one of the enemy's attacks. So let's say you are supposed to get hit, um, you know, like five times this turn. Instead, you'll get hit four times because it nullifies one of their attacks, right? And... Uh, you know, when you use an active skill, that's only a one-time thing, but it also does this when you use a super attack, when you perform a super attack every single time your key is 24. 
And since these guys are getting so much key all the time, um, you can pretty much consistently get 24 key with them, or at least like, you know, most turns, right? You can get 24 key pretty easily. So, uh, that's pretty freaking awesome. That that's pretty freaking awesome in my opinion. So essentially, it's almost like their 18 key, almost, almost like their 18 key nullifies enemies' actions. So. Um, yeah, great easy A right there, man. Huge boost to the attack and defense. This guy's gonna be getting, you know, even more defense now. Before, he was actually pretty decently tanky after he supered. But now, he's getting defense plus 140% to start. He's getting more attack, and then more attack, um, for every appearance. And then, um, yeah, no, it's just really good. Now, the active skill, I believe, is exactly the same. From what I can tell, yeah, same condition, same ability. Nothing's changed there, but just overall a very, very good Extreme Z Awakening. He's going to be um, quite impressive, for sure. Now, moving on to the Vegeta, who is actually very similar, as you might expect. Uh, before the EZ8, leader skills, Vegeta's family, category key plus 3, HP plus 130%, and attack and defense plus 170%. Or super SDR types, key plus 3, HP, attack and defense plus 120%. 12 key super attack massively raises attack for one turn and causes colossal damage. And 18 key super is massively raises attack and defense for one turn and causes mega colossal damage. Passive defense plus 80%, attack plus 20% at the start of each turn, up to 80%, plus an additional key plus 2 per rainbow key sphere obtained. Sorry, uh, rainbow or STR key sphere obtained. Medium chance of evading enemy super attacks and countering with tremendous power. And uh, the active skill is the same as Vegeta's, or sorry, the same as Goku's. Now, as far as the EZA goes, um, new leader skill is Vegeta's family category key plus 3, HP attack and defense plus 180%, or Super STR types key plus 3, HP attack and defense plus 130%. Super attack, 12 key, massively raises attack and raises defense for one turn and causes uh, colossal damage. And 18 key super massively raises attack and defense for one turn and causes mega cluster damage and greatly lowers defense and uh, passive attack and defense plus 140 percent plus an additional attack plus 10 percent and defense plus 20 percent at the start of each turn um attack up to 30 percent and defense up to 60 percent so for the goku he's just getting attack plus 20 percent at the start of each turn up to 60 percent but vegeta is getting Attack plus 10% and defense plus 20%. So he's getting both attack and defense instead of just uh, just defense. Uh, or sorry, uh, just attack. Yeah, instead of just attack. Okay. And then uh, plus an additional key plus 2 per rainbow or STR key sphere obtained. Plus an additional key plus 1 per type key sphere obtained. STR excluded. Um, medium chance of evading enemy super attacks and countering with tremendous power. Nullifies enemies' actions for one turn when facing two or more enemies when using an active skill, or when performing a super attack when key is 24. So there you go guys, that is the Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta Extreme Z Awakening, LR Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta Extreme Z Awakening. Still crazy to me that these guys are getting easy A's this early, man, I just did not see it coming. I really didn't, but I'm happy about it. This means that next year, or maybe this year, who knows man, maybe it's gonna be like a part four, part five. It's going to be a part 5 to the anniversary, where we get the 5th anniversary easy ace. This anniversary is just never going to end. <laughs> I feel like it's just going to keep going forever. Um, obviously, it's going to end eventually, but it's just... The, the amount of content, the amount of, like, just crazy stuff we've been getting from this anniversary is just... It's just unreal, man. It's unreal. So, um, I'm going to go rest my voice now, because uh, I'm struggling. I, I really am. But, a sore throat is not going to stop me from getting this news out to you guys. Uh, hopefully you guys are excited. Let me know in the comments down below what you're actually the most excited for. Is it the is it the LR Super Saiyan 4 EZAs? Is it the uh, Dokkan Fist Ginyu? Or maybe um, Team Bardock's EZA or the LR uh, Goku Jr. and Vegeta Jr. Regardless of which one it is, they're all coming soon on JP. So look forward to it. And... Uh, that's it guys, um, as always, if you liked today's video, then make sure to like the damn video. Sub to the channel, if you're new, hit that notification bell so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. 
And uh, until next time, have an awesome, awesome day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media. Signing out.